a vulture perched on the man. Cody found himself surrounded by deep abysses. He shouted his father's name, but there was no response. He tried to climb the rocks to escape but almost fell to his death. He could only cling to the rocks in midair with his hands. Luckily, a heavy rain poured down. The deep cliff was filled with rainwater. Cody couldn't hold on any longer and had no choice but to leap into the rushing current. The next day, he woke up in the mud. His leg couldn't move anymore. He crawled to a nearby water pool and took a sip of ancient wine from 20,000 years ago. He then removed his shoes, which had swollen his feet beyond recognition. He placed his foot between two rocks and made a simple splint for himself. The boy began his journey and finally reached the top of the cliff. There, he found the gravestone his father had erected for him. Feeling utterly hopeless, without his father, he couldn't find his way back home without him. In the distance, he heard the howling of wolves. He limped away from the cliff, with the wolf pack closely chasing him. Cody had no choice but to crawl towards